Hmm, hello everyone. So today, actually, I got a lot of questions from the students that how we start our PC preparation. That is a physiotherapy competence exam, Canada. So how we start? Uh, what to study? Where to study? And what Global Physio Academy provide? So that inspired me. Like, let's make a video. So at least you get the idea. So hello everyone, Mamta Gansara from the Global Physio Academy, giving you the idea what to do, where to do, and how to do. First, PCE, Physiotherapy Competence Exam. This exam, it is evaluation of your knowledge. In this exam, you are getting scenario-based questions. You have to give answer most appropriate, ethical point of view, professional point of view, intervention point of view and your best judgment and for that you are aware about theoretical component you are aware about the ethical component you are aware about the associated topics so pce evaluate students knowledge overall in terms of correlation and now what global physio academy provide Global Physio Academy provide PC written preparation with four component because I believe for the students who want to clear their exam, they have to do all these four component. First component is theoretical. So I we have more than 65 lectures of the theoretical classes. These classes, you can get the access of recordings until your first trial. This is not time bound. This theoretical class is giving you 100% idea, guidance that what is the theory, how it is associated with your component, each component I'm going to explain very well in detail. So once you go through the theoretical classes, at least you can get the idea what to read from the book. And it is easy for the student to understand the topic, to understand the reading, and then always reading done with my, like under my guidance, my students are going with the book and it is very, very easy. Second component is ethical classes. So ethical classes, there are 15 lectures. Out of that, 12 is a live lectures plus recording is available for until your first trial. These ethics giving you the idea about how your theoretical component correlated with ethics and PCE ethics is totally different, including all the things, consent, patient-centered approach, communication skill, therapist uh, safety, patient safety, ethical practice, professionalism, teamwork, acute management, Patients' uh, questions and how to navigate with the answers, when to refer to whom. So this all is associated with your scenario based, right? So ethics, to understand the ethics is very important, not only for your written exam, also for your clinical practice. So I am concluding all these things in my ethical classes, which is approximately like 15 classes. 11 to 12 is a theoretical, live plus recording. And remaining three, I'm giving ethics mentoring. So I'm personally taking idea that what student understood and whether it they are appropriate, not appropriate. Third component is a mentoring because I believe that students, those who are done with the theory, but they are not ready for the exam. In the exam, they are come across with the MCQs. So MCQ is only provided like understanding of the question answers correlation of your theory with the questions. You are getting mastered with the questions when you are doing multiple questions, multiple practice and practice makes a man perfect. So in the mentoring, I will prepare my students with n number of the question answers and correlation. For example, scenario is Burns patient. That Burns patient we are going with the question answer in terms of intervention, acute management, 
patient's depression and the different scenario. Patient has a question and we're going to refer to any uh, like appropriate team member. Orthosis, appropriate positioning. So in one bunch vignette, that is a topic of the intervention, professionalism, teamwork, orthosis. And if it is a shoulder joint, definitely we are working with the shoulder joint. If it is a hand joint, we are working with the hand joints. So that way, one scenario, students are engaged with the end number of the question answers with correlated topics in mentoring. And that is a core part for my Global Physics Academy. And the final one is the MOOC exam. I prepare my exams, which is mimic like the Vignet, and which, uh, which giving the clear idea that how this Vignet scenario asking with the questions. Okay. So there are total three MOOC exam, 200 questions each. What I believe that students are lack with the intervention questions. So purposefully, I prepared 100 questions. It is That is only intervention. Another test for the 100 question, which is only examination. And another test for the 100 question, which is only ethics. That is evaluation. Mini mock, periodically question answers. Even during the theoretical class, I prepare my student with the question answer right from beginning. Because that what they have to end up. They have to give the exam with the MCQ based. So they understood the theory, but how this theory they are getting the questions and how they are getting answers by excluding the three wrong answer. So Global Physio Academy provide their best uh, theoretical mentoring, ethics and the MOOC exam to the students to achieve their success in their path to become a resident PT. And one more important thing is that batch size. So particularly for me, quality is important. I am not exceeding my students, more than 25 to 30 students in mentoring because every student is unique. Every student has their own strength and own weakness. So being a mentor, I should know what is important for your preparation. And that's why I am providing 100% focus with my student. And that is very, very helpful for them. So this what is a global physio providing to the student. Global physio also provide the student how to do what are the preparation. This preparation is a not short thing preparation. It is minimum eight to nine month preparation. This exam is very easy. If you are prepared, this exam is very hard if you are not prepared. So the thing is, it is very, very important. Student need to prepare with every component, every theoretical aspect, then this exam will be easy. As simple as this, rather than taking a stress, what to do, how to do, that is important. And books is your best friend. When you are doing the theory and when you are going with the question answer, you come to know that how this question answer correlate with your theory, even though you know the theory, but sometimes student has a difficulty to give the answer. So all this minor thing is very much focused in Global Physio Academy. And uh, I'm really happy with my students' result as well. And that what I'm providing. If you have any question, feel free to contact Global Physio Academy at the red gmail.com or my contact number 416-879-1986. Thank you very much and wish you best of luck.